and sit down. Face it on his own. He's coming for a villain known as Adonis. He'll do it. You'll be there. Be back in now. First man to learning. Good morning, everyone. That's right. First man to learning curve has been extended. Whoop, 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 whoop. Extended like Ron Jeremy when he sees a hot babe on the porn set. If you know what I mean, if you don't get that reference, well, then you should Google search what I just said. Hello, everybody. It's been extended 28 days to go. Let's build and build and build, guys. Let's get this campaign going to the moon. I need your help with that. Thank you for sharing everybody in the chat. How are you? I am doing great today. It is time. Good morning. Yo. Uh, Stat Zero in the his house. How are you, everybody? Uh, let's see what else we got going on here. Some questions going back and forth. There it is. Hyper Kaiju throwing it down. Prater says, are you guys new mods? They are. <clears throat> oh, my God. That was disgusting. Well, that's why I wear jeans, so I can wipe my hands. AJ is here. Hello. I'm blinded by I'll have to check that out later. Uh, I will have to check that video out later for sure. Oh, AJ, give yourself credit. That's not too much responsibility. JP North Free, what up? Um, let's see. Val's posting it up for me. It is extended, guys. Share it is caring. Sharing is caring. Uh oh, I was thinking about C2E2. Well, you saw what uh, New York Comic Con did yesterday. So if C2E2 throws down the, you got to be vaccinated to get into the show or you're not getting in, could be a little difficult. So we shall see. Oh, thank you. You know, they say bless you because they uh, wasn't the thing saying uh, uh, demons escaping the body or some crap like that. That's why it's like, hey, you got to say good bless you because demons just escaped your body. Oh, I have uh, the single issues by him. There we go, dropping it German style. So I have the single issues and I have the hard covers of that stuff. I love it. Uh, Cecil E2. Oh, dude, that that's good. In fact, here, let me show you. Hold on. Uh, here's one of them right here. Captain Cunnock. This is volume two. Oh, doesn't say. Oh, there it is. Volume two right there. When you sneeze, it's the devil leaving your skull. <gasps> Why would you say that? Uh, and here is volume one of uh, Captain Cut Up. Do, 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 do. Look at that. Oh, goodness. Right there. So uh, with that in mind, uh, I should get to doing some of the old inking on the book or on the on the cover I did. 
I'll have to put this somewhere so I can see it because that's a, that is good to, to have in front of me. So uh, let's switch. Uh, let's see. Are there ever any good cons near Southern Indiana, Chicago's? Uh, I don't know. Repop isn't getting my medical records. If that's the case, I'm a no for C2E2. Demanding my medical records is a HIPAA. I, dude, it's just getting crazy. Here it is. If you can see it. See it? Oh, look at that. That's what we'll be inking today. That's what we'll be inking today. I got to throw a little light down on my desk so I can see. Oh, look. You don't need to see that. Only I do. Uh, I got to turn that on, too. Let me, let me turn the light on. Where is it? It's right here. There we go. Uh, all right. I'm going to... Uh, I wish there was a way I could darken my monitor without turning it off. Is there a way to darken my monitor without turning it off, my Cintiq? Because when I turn it off, it makes, uh, you know, it looks weird. I get a little skippage on my uh, on my stuff. Look, here's the ink. Uh, let's put the ink thing out of the way. Let's get my brush, uncap it, because we're going to get right to work. Oh. The brush was a little hard. Don't know if I washed it or not. My wife hates it when I do this. Mmm. 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 Go to settings and select video. All right. I'll try that. Let's see. I don't know what you mean exactly, but let's try it. Oops. So let's see, hardware and sound, nope, network, nope, nope, system, nope. Oh, where's my stupid uh, display? So let's see, network, internet, nope, hardware, display. Oh. Why is it my display clicking on when I click display? Oh, uh, you know how to please a brush, Andy. Oh, I do. I do. The wife doesn't like the taste of paint when you kiss her. Luckily, it's not paint. That's ink. But I know what you're saying. I'm clicking on display. Nothing's happened. What the heck? Why is nothing happening when I click on display? You know, that's just annoying. You know, I'm just going to turn it off. Do you have control panel? I do. I have it up and I'm clicking on display. Oh, appearance and personalization. Yeah. Oh, hold on. Nope. convince Helen to come up to the studio and say hi to us you know if I was in a different room in the house she would definitely come in but since I'm not in a different room of the house yeah she's not so I'm just turning the, the lamp off all right let's see how this look oh that's bright let's see how this looks when I uh, switch cameras here Ask Helen to turn the child lock off on my Cintiq. It's hurtful as hell. You guys know how to hurt a guy. That's it. You can see my screen now. Oh, look at that. Ooh. Oh, that's nice and bright for you guys. Oh, I bet you like that. Do you like that? Nice DNA shirt there, Andy. Hyper Kaiju, if you like this DNA shirt, you should uh, go to the link below in the description for T Public and go buy yourself one. Or First Man or Penumbra. There is a Penumbra shirt now trapped in a garage closet. That's one big garage closet if that's what I'm trapped in. Just saying. One day I'll do a studio tour. How's that? Would you guys like to see a studio tour one day? 
because I'll do it. Don't you uh, don't you tempt me? I will do a studio tour. T Public, thank you, Hyper Kaiju. Slapping that there. Is this too bright? I wonder. No, not really. All right, let's see. Heck yes. Oh, heck yes to the studio tour. Okay, well we can do that one day. Ugh. A little bleed going on here. That's okay. I can deal with it. I did a little more penciling on the old first man pinup yesterday. I got it to the point where all I got to do now is ink the background. Or ink. Pencil the background. Sorry, I haven't started inking it yet. Don't want you guys to think you've missed out you haven't so yeah so I got a pencil the background let's just there we go <laughs> I've got the old Captain Connick book on my lap for reference Never mind the Cowboys gear. Damn, Hyper Kaiju, that's hurtful. As I tell Dennis, Hyper Kaiju, uh, words hurt. It doesn't matter if it's in text or voice. Your words hurt. Um, what was I going to say about that? You know, that Dallas thing was actually done for a client that wanted something like the Cowboys, and then he never paid for it. So I took off his branding and put it up on my site for sale. Because if the dude ain't paying for it, he ain't getting it. And if I ever see that guy, there's going to be hell to pay. Because uh, he worked me pretty good for uh, revisions. I just replied on Cecil's last Twitter asking when I have Andy on the show. Everybody do the same. Oh, thanks, Val. I actually did talk to him yesterday uh, through Twitter, DM. He says he hasn't forgot, and hopefully the end of the month, because he's traveling. So hopefully that'll work. Inking a sketch cover is difficult because they're so small. Nice. What do you call a drug ring in Dallas? A huddle? Oh, damn. AJ, I love when you throw out veiled threats to people you don't know how to find or would never recognize. I know. It is a veiled threat, but it does piss me off that I did a lot of work and got nothing for it. Oh, I've got the guy's name and uh, phone number. I could dox the hell out of that guy, too, but I won't because I don't do that stuff. I should do that though. Throw out his name on Facebook. I think he's on Facebook. I could throw out his name on Facebook and Twitter and be like, this guy doesn't pay for work. That's what I get for not having a written contract. Because I'm a classy guy. I'm classy and I'm sassy. Yes, I am. Hold on, let me adjust this camera up some. I'm going to try to adjust the camera.
See how that is. Oh, that's better. Or nowadays, that uh, honor the handshake deal. Exactly. Was there ever a client so unreasonable that you just said get lost or are you a consummate professional? Um, I've had disagreements with clients before. I had a back and forth with this one guy I was doing some spot illustrations for. For a book he was writing. I did a bunch of spot illustrations for one book and the book came out. And I got to say, it looked pretty good. He's, I got a copy of it. Uh, it was for a novel. Uh, and I liked the way it came out. But uh, it got to a point where for the second one, I was doing some spot illustrations. And uh, he was just such a control freak. I could not deal with it anymore from the standpoint of I would do something and he would just micromanage every aspect of it. And I said, you know, it's probably best if we stop working together. And uh, he didn't like that. And I, I, uh, I refunded money because he did pay me a deposit for everything. And I refunded his deposit. And uh, that, of course, didn't make him too happy. But, you know, for the amount of money he was paying me, it wasn't worth the hassle I was getting. I've had pros never deliver commissions that were paid for regardless of how pissed off you are. It's not cool to dox them. Yeah, I'm not going to dox anybody. I'm not saying anybody's name right now. I don't even remember the guy's name actually for the, the Dallas thing. So I'd have to actually go back and look it up and stuff. So, and I'm not doing that. You know what? I'm going to have to do a little white out. So I started drawing this at Megacon. There we go. No problem. Do a little white out there. That's what it's for. That's good. Never had that happen. AJ Tom, were those guys really big artists? When I do a commission, I try to get it done within a reasonable amount of time. I also tell the person how long it'll take and uh, stay in touch so I can let them know. John Tompkins, hello to you. I hope you've subscribed to my channel. I see you're on Facebook. Awesome. But please pop over to YouTube and hit the subscribe button. All you guys subscriptions really count. Hyper Kaiju, why don't you send that nice uh, man the link to the YouTube channel so he can uh, go over there and subscribe. Wow, a legendary artist. Man, I'm sorry to hear that. I wonder if it's somebody I know. Yep, that sucks. Sorry to hear that, AJ. Oh, I just noticed I'm off camera with the way I'm doing this. So, got to. Nope. See if that works better. Oh, there we go. Thank you for popping that link, Hyper. I appreciate it.
do 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 I got my reference in front of me. Got to say, I like uh, Will Do, thank, says John Tompkins. Thank you. Watched this season finale to uh, Superman and Lois last night. I like it. I like what they're doing with that show. As you can see on his head, it's hard to see the whiteout, but I did whiteout right here over the logo, so he pops in front of the logo. Commissions have gone from 20 in the 90s to hundreds today. They've become too costly. Yeah. Uh, how do you prevent that from happening, whether you're the commissioner or commissionee? You really can't. Even if you have a written contract, what are you going to do? Take them to small claims court for a, for a nominal you know, fee, even if it's hundreds, even if it's a few hundred bucks for a commission, you know, small claims court is like anything under 500 in most states. So I guess if the commission is like a thousand or something, you could take them to small claims court. But if the guy's in a different state, that makes it difficult. You'd have to send out Vinny to break his legs. Or if you're going after the artist, you send out Vinny to break his arms. Uh, yeah, that's what I usually do. How do you prevent that? When I take on commissions, uh, unless it's somebody I know that I've work, worked with before, I'll usually ask for half the money up front and then the other half when it's done. Yeah, I mean, that's the other thing you can do. Sam Graham Nolan over there, he'll straighten that shit out. That's true. Send Graham Nolan. When in doubt, call Graham. Graham Nolan, the new John Wayne. I love this little community we have here. Follow me on Twitter as well. Uh, I posted a little Twitter pic today saying this was my first comic book. What was yours? So if you're on Twitter, you want to go over and reply to me with a screenshot of the cover to the first comic you ever bought. That'd be cool. Of course, you guys watch my channel, so you know the first one I bought. Graham just did a whole stream on things he loved. I know. I assume I was mentioned. Wasn't I? Was I not mentioned on the Graham Nolan stream of things he loves? I mean, was it not... Uh, me was it not his wife because you know i get being above below his wife but then second was me right oh marvel's what the number two john byrne that's a great book still have it have it on my spin rack I think I've been thinking about a theme sketchbook. I'm really considering Graham Nolan verse sketchbook I mentioned yesterday. That's a tough one, though, because you're asking an artist to draw two characters fighting in a sketchbook. Now, if you're doing it as a commission, 
not a con thing, it would be easier because, you know, that's not something I'd want to draw to con. Oh, totally thinking commissions. Okay, that's cool. Book of Bane. I'm in the Book of Bane. First comic I ever bought was either an Archie or a Star Wars Tales of a Jedi. Nice. Oh, for either a He-Man action figure or Disney. Cool. Uh, I think my first comic, Gen 13, number 14. Oh, that's cool. Of course, all these came out when I was a professional. So, uh, wow, well, guys, thanks for making this guy feel old. Nice. Might give this a George Freeman rendering type of feel. He has a specific way he would do his rendering. So thinking about that, Dark Horse was my jam in the 90s. Jam. A little seam to the glove. Render unto Foreman. Freeman is what I meant to say. Freeman. Noctera number six comes out today. Looking forward to that bad boy. Hand done. Oh, got a lot of ink on the brush just then. It's okay. I'm a professional. Uh, I should probably do that other hand, but I just don't feel like it right now, so I'll do some costume stuff. Do the old costume lines. Oh, I got here. Here's what excites an artist. I got new whiteout pens coming in the mail today. That's right. I uh, 
I checked out some whiteout pens at the show. Now I'm trying to remember who showed them to me. No pun intended. Uh, who did show those pens to me? Ooh, that's higher. Damn, now I can't remember. Somebody showed me a whiteout pen at Megacon that I really thought was cool. And uh, I ended up buying some that come in the mail today. I bought a three pack. I liked it better than what I was using, but damn if I can't remember who it was. This dude's twisting a little bit. Speaking of Andy, you have sketch favorites, characters you love sketching. Uh, let's see, before I answer that, I have a few commit, play to the artist's strengths, choose something to have fun with, don't request something simple, you'll inevitably be disappointed. Uh, actually, now that I think of it, it might have been Dawn comic followed by, oh, I was drawn to the ladies. Who wasn't at that age? All right, let's do his head. Smooth goodness. Oh, so the question, do you have sketch favorites? Nope. I prefer to be told what to draw or request. You know, if somebody comes up and they're like, hey, I just want to sketch. And I'm like, great. Who do you want? And they're like, whatever you want, dude. I actually don't like that. I'd rather them tell me who they like. I'm going to try and do a little George Bridge, George Bridgman, George Freeman face jawline. His jaw angles out some. And it swoops in. And he does this concave thing like that. Does he have a dimple? Nope, no dimple on the chin. Uh, use the Presto Whiteout pen that Aaron uses, and I also use a Uniball gel pen. I have the Presto one, but I was talking about a thick one for like areas like this. You need a real thick pen to cover up that logo. How would I react if someone asked me to do a Graham Nolan sketch? I mean, I wouldn't care. I wouldn't guarantee a great likeness, but I would do my best. I mean, whatever. Graham Nolan fighting first man, maybe? I assume the commissioner would want first man winning in that fight. Look at that. Look at him pop over that logo now. It's bam. All right, let me do his mask. Oh, I like that. I didn't do, draw his mask right. I'll have to fix that next. It goes like this. It does not go the typical way. Fix the mask. No pen can obtain the power to draw Graham. He's bang. Oh, no one beats Graham Nolan in a fight. Oh, my wife always more of a sketchbook lover over comics. She saw Arnold Presti's book and loved it. Cool. Aaron's book is nice. Oh, I saw Aaron's campaign video yesterday. That's all I can say. But I saw it. And it's awesome. It's 
you know, when you're one of the professionals, you get to see stuff like that early. Uh, second, are the pens you ordered big enough to cover large areas? Is so you need to show those on the stream when you get them? Oh, I will. I will definitely show them. Hey, I just got a notification that John Tompkins subscribed to my channel. Thank you, buddy. The more subscribers, the better. I'd love to get to a point where I could be like, I got this many subscribers. Let's start doing memberships. Sunny days, do, 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 sunny days. See, oh my God, is that a Partridge Family song? <laughs> Told you I would, yes you did. Oh, you're watching it there too. Thanks, Jay Tompkins. Oh, time to get Killadong back out. No way. Can I be an honorary professional and bald with a beard and glasses, please? Looking good, Smitty. Thank you, Billy Ray. Oh, it was Billy Ray. I think it was Billy Ray that showed me the whiteout pen. Billy, confirm. It was you that showed me that whiteout pen. They're showing up today, Billy Ray. Thank you. Sunshine day. The way Linzer draws women is amazing. Oh my God. The way he does is so awesome. Dude, Linsner, so good. His coloring on that stuff. Mm. Linzer is one of the most incredible imaginations when it comes to wardrobe and costume. Jay does. And his coloring, man, the way he colors that stuff, he uses markers and paint. It's insane. I got to really get in here. Oh, look at my hairy chin chin. Guilty as charged. That's right. It was Ray Dog that introduced me to those pens. Billy Ray, uh, put the name brand of the pen down here in the chat if you want. Sunshine day. Dave Cassidy, gone too soon. Never knew his daughter was uh, the chick on Arrow. So after he passed away, Katie Cassidy.
first comic book I as a kid was two comics, Godzilla and the Human Fly. Oh, I love the Human Fly. I still have them. Val says, please remember to like the channel. You're damn right, Val. That gets shown right here. There you go. Oh, yeah. AJ's got it. Dotson, great. I've seen Dotson's cover for uh, Aaron's campaign. It's awesome. Uh, Bud Root, good friend. Great friend of mine, actually. Very cool. Love his work. Doesn't do enough comics. I must have traced the Crypt of Dawn. Oh, yeah. I bought How to Draw Books, Trying to Learn. I hear you, brother. I hear you. All right, I can get back up here. Uh, let's see, what was I doing? What was I doing? Oh, I know what I was doing. There we go. Fine brushwork. Herb Trent Godzilla comics are pretty cool. I only have, uh, oh, wait, I take it back. I was going to say I only have a few. I don't have any anymore. Oh, somebody just posted their first comic on Twitter was X-Men Executioner Song number 14. I still have that book. Great Andy Kubert, Mark Pennington art. Mark Pennington, good friend. Saw him over the weekend. Met Mark when I was at the Kubert School. Oh, what is this? I don't need that right there. The Godzilla Essential. Dude, that's hard to find. That thing's worth money. You should look that up on eBay. Seriously. Have you ever seen that Muse book that Terry Dotson did, Holy Schmoly's? Have I seen it? Of course I've seen it. Now, do I own it? I don't. Uh, didn't Mark Pennington use to ink Bart? Yeah, he did. Yes, he did. He inked Bart really nicely. Sunshine day. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Sunshine day. Hey, 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 hey. Ooh, what do you guys think about that? Tell me I can't hit the high notes. I'll hit them. I'll hit them hard. I hit those high no notes hard. That was creepy. Sunshine day. Let's see. The pencil is the Posca. It was recommended by Dave Finch. That's right. The pen is a P-O-S-C-A. Uh, is it? Found it, at a con found it for 10 bucks at a con. Yeah, you should Google search it. I think it is worth some good dough right now. Seriously. Um, they're a wonderful blend of Godzilla. Yep. 
So there's the pen, guys. Right there, Google search it, Amazon. It's a paint pen. You want white, of course. Uh, I hear that the insane detail into her costumes. She was interesting, too. She had a different costume wardrobe every series. I assume you're talking about Dawn. So there you go. Billy Ray dropping the knowledge bombs. Oops. Uh, let's see. I need to find an area of black. Whenever I don't use my brush for a bit before I put it back down, I always find an area of black just in case the point's not good to repoint it. Sunshine day. Hey. Beep, 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 sunshine day, hey, hey. Oh, I know what we can play. I'll just start singing some words and you tell me the song. I've had the Godzilla Essential Mighty Bay watch list for months. You can pick it up for about 60 bucks, baby. 60 bucks, see, told you. Uh, what's this song? If you like pina coladas, mm, 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 getting caught in the rain. Mm, 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 if you're not in the... Uh, uh, mm, mm, sips of champagne. Mm, 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 if you like making love at midnight. In the do mm, 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 I look. For, uh, uh, right to me and escape. Do 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 do. Rupert Holmes. Whoa! Could you please switch up to something else? Maybe some Kenny Rogers. Kenny Rogers. Kenny Rogers. You got to know when to hold them, when to hold them, know when to fold them, when to fold them, know when to rock away, know when to run. You better count your money while you're sitting at the table. And the deal is done. There. Are you happy? This is why I need super chats so I can get a tip jar. You guys to know when to hold them, when to hold them, know when to fold them, when to fold them, know when to walk away, know when to run. You better count your money while you're sitting at the table. When the deal is done. Told you I'm going for that George Freeman vibe. Oh, that's the most lyrics that you've correctly strung together ever on this stream. Dude. 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 What else? What's up, guy? What's up, dude? Hey, guys. Don't have a good day. Have a great day. Oh, I am a Kenny Rogers fan. How about this, though? Are you ready for this one? You guys busting my balls. Pay me to stop singing. You know it. How about this? Um, oh, wait. Hold on. I got to put some lines down here. Not the type Hunter Biden does. Come on, guys. No. How about this for a song? Ready? 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 Mo Fantasy, what's up? Get with the other CG Titans, host a few streams of your channel. That should get you a few hours. It should, yeah. How'd you like Free Guy? Loved it. By the way, how is this? Hold on, you guys. I'm the king of rock. There is none higher. Sucker MCs, call me sire. To burn my kingdom, you must use fire. I won't stop rocking till I retire and I rock this body and come correct. Nah, 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 nah. Yeah, you're right. Kenny Rogers was the song that I know the most. 
sad. You got to know when to hold them, when to hold them, know when to fold them, when to fold them, know when to walk away, I say know when to run, you better count your money, when you're sitting at the table, na 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 na, to the deal ends done. King of Rock, Run DMC, yes, Raising Hell, Side B, yes, was that the Beastie Boys? Uh, we need to really bust Dennis's chops from the DNA show because he hates, Dennis hates the Beastie Boys. How do you hate the Beastie Boys? I don't understand. You best to count your money when it's sitting at the table. Thanks, guys. Now I have that going through my head, and I don't mean that. Thank you sincerely. Now you got to think of another song. You serious? Fight for your right to party. You got to fight for your right to party. You got to fight for your right. How can someone hate the Beastie Boys? Time to get a new sidekick. That's the truth. You need to come on tonight at 5 and tell them that. You can't hate the Beasties. Because you got to count your money when you're sitting at the table. I will say on the entire drive to Megacon and back, it was sidekick. Oh, well, ouch, Dennis. Shh, don't tell him that. Um, on the entire drive, we were rocking uh, to uh, the good old Hair Nation on... Uh, Sirius XM, so I'm surprised my personal assistant hasn't chimed in yet. And you know what I mean when I say personal assistant. Christine. Ha ha ha. Oh my God, did somebody say my name? And why are you singing over there? You suck at singing, Andy. Stop it. Wow, JP Roca says Dennis was already a lost cause as a Packer fan. Oh man, the shade is being thrown. You guys should really come on our streams at five o'clock tonight. Talk it up. Wasn't going to go there, brother, Ronald Shaw, but I've moved away only to have my childhood vanish. What, grown up now? You didn't see those? Oh, now I'm whistling the gambler. Damn it. See, by doing light line work like this, you're just indicating the form very gently. 
when you do solid blacks for line work, it's uh, you're indicating it a lot harder. Or saw blacks for uh, rendering, which I'll do on the black part of his costume here in a second. That just indicates a slight indentation ever slow, so gently slow. I also like the way George does the shadows like this. He'll give it a beefy line like this. And then he'll break it up with some uh, lines on the inside like this. Oh, yes. Any Cinderella on that Hair Nation channel? Of course Cinderella's on the Hair Nation channel, son. Cinderella on Hair Nation. Of course Cinderella's on Hair Nation. Good Lord, what hair nation would it be without Cinderella? You best count your money. Let's see. Prince released an album from the grave. Whoa, Prince was awesome. Let's be honest, Hair Nation Blast from a Ford Escape, not very metal of you. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is the hate on the Ford Escape? See, I busted a rhyme to keep up with the times. I don't know why you hating. That car is fantastic and great. You need to slow your roll before I pump out that rock and roll. I just rapped. Ah, uh, George Freeman would be so proud of me. Rocking his sweet type of rendering on his drawing. All right, I think it's time to do some black areas of the costume. I think, I think, I think I got most of the white areas done. Or I should say the red areas of the costume. And he's a G.I. Joe's roadblock of the professionals. You're damn right.
Let's see. Shine this up. Did you guys see the Black Adam teaser that they put out? Gold Gauntlets Comics. Good morning to you. That little bit of gray helps uh, turn the form and uh, put that in a little shadow, if you're wondering. All right, let's get to doing some blacks on the costume. That might be a little harder. Mm -hmm. Just looking at some reference. You got to know the Black Adam teaser looked like a Mortal Kombat game ending. Oh, but the, but the, but the, but the, oh, actually, and uh, speaking of free guy, so we're going to review it later on the Dennis and Andy show. Uh, but I can tell you, I'll probably go see it again because my wife didn't get to go and uh, we told her how awesome it was. So, uh, that's how much I liked it. Let's see it twice. Oh, yeah, goopy. Oh, yeah, goopiness. Chunk, get up there, little goop. Ah, uh, Ink and love to watch you, Ink. Just did I just hear you start to sing the gambler? Oh, did you ever? You, my friend, missed out on a lot of gambler singing. I'm not quite sure the chat wants to hear that again, but it was good. I am Captain Connor. Oh, my wife's your wife's in another room singing a gambler now. Well, you're welcome. Uh, there's a Black Adam teaser. Where? YouTube. Where else, brother? Everything's on the YouTube. Thank <laughs> you. 
to paraphrase Wesley Snipes on white. I want to show that because that's funny. Uh, what's this? It's hard work busting on Andy for an entire stream. Well, you want to earn that paycheck. You better work it harder. You're not doing a great job. Earn that paycheck. Bust it. You do need to come up with something better for EVS's channel. Come on now, be creative. I know you can do it. Ugh, the ink bleeds a little bit on this paper. It bleeds a little bit. Gotta admit, when I started inking this, I didn't quite know what style I was going to go with. Uh, what's my favorite part, penciling or inking? Uh, I mean, I like... I like uh, penciling better, but inking is kind of relaxing. I look sharp, sharp, sharp. I don't comment on EVS to show. There's too many folks in there. Also, it's too personal considering my Hall of Heroes memories. Oh, I get it. What live streaming software do you use? StreamYard is what uh, most everybody uses. StreamYard.com. And I just got a couple webcams set up. Let me tell you, these webcams are great for my only fan. I mean... Uh, Oh, it's coming together. I love it when a plan comes together. Oops. There's no oops in comics. There's no oops in comics. Yes, sir.
Oh, she's getting there. Ronald Shaw seriously created an OnlyFans account? Are you kidding? I've actually never been to the site, so I don't know much. I thought it was just for chicks. So, I don't know. Eh, I'm going to have to leave that for now. So I do want to do this. All right, let's do some ribcage stuff, shall we? Oops, we hired Bendis and his team of flying monkeys to mess up legacy characters that we have no right to corrupt. Oops, in comics. <laughs> That's funny. Pop in those ribs. Ribs. Oh, next up on the movie list, by the way, is Don't Breathe 2, if you're wondering. So, uh, no idea they were making a sequel to that movie, but they did. Dennis watched uh, one last week, so he's caught up for when we go see number two. I need to find you out how much I miss podcasting. Podcasting's fun. As someone who has asthma, a movie titled Don't Breathe is really unappealing to me. I have asthma. Keeping up with Ethan is a full-time job. It can be. He does do a lot of streams. Streaming in the night. I like chatting. Streaming in the night. It is exciting. Streaming in the night. Na 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 na. Streaming in the night is invigorating. Streaming in the night is elevating. Streaming in the night. Just the stuff that will get me flagged on Facebook and Insta. Damn, you're making me want to see some of that stuff, buddy.
streaming in the night is in well then i draw i always draw a full nude first and then add clothes i don't know why it's, i mean i used to do that but now with you know you know basic shapes you don't have to draw a full nude and then add clothes i mean unless you like to Man, I'm wrapping this up quick. Another arm, legs, some, uh, what do you call it? Uh, sh the Canadian flag shields on his belt and his head, and this baby's done. Thank you all for keeping me company. I really do appreciate it. Ronald Shaw Art on Insta. You're going to get a follow later. I want to see some of this stuff. What is this new Star Wars that Uncle E is talking about? Is it the manga anime stuff I saw him post yesterday? I saw him stream last night. Well, I didn't see it. I saw when I woke up that he streamed last night at midnight or 12.30 is when he sent the link around. Obviously, 12.30, this guy right here was cutting some wood as in sleeping. Bad Batch is the newest thing. I haven't seen it. My daughter loves Bad Batch. Season finale was last week. She loved it. I don't know enough about Star Wars to really get into it. But she wanted me to watch it with her. So like a good papa, I did. Oh, yeah, yeah, this is going wild. Wild child! It's a wild child. Big city, big city nights. Na, 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 na. Let's see. Here we go again on my own. Stat Zero, have a great day. We're doing scorpions now. Big city. Rock you like a hurricane. Love me. Scor saw scorpions in concert. 
one thing I learned about Dennis on our drive is uh, he's seen many, many concerts, and I have seen uh, five, if that. I have seen Scorpions in concert. This is in no particular order. Still the night and the hell moonlight. It's the still the still the still the night. Um, I've seen Billy Idol, Scorpions, Hootie and the Blowfish, Trans Siberian Orchestra, Cheap Trick, and there you have it. Still of the night. God, I wish I could play music while I work and do this with you guys, but nope. Can't do it. Can't do it. Booty and the Blowfish don't count. What? How dare you? I love Booty and the Blowfish. Why don't they count? Uh, Booty and the Blowfish do count. Uh, oh, I love Def Leppard. Photograph, I don't want to photograph. We're not gonna take it. Oh, we're not gonna take it. We're not gonna take it anymore. <laughs> Na 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 thing to do. Boring and confiscated. Not a thing for you. I need a karaoke machine that you guys can't see. And then I can just start banging these lyrics the right way. And you guys would be like, holy shit. He studied up and learned the lyrics. Oh, yeah. Time to do his face. His face. Got to do his face. Hold on. Got to see something. Got a text message from the old wife. You get a text from the wife, you check it. Let's see. Let's see. And condescending Mona Shaneth. Oh, what's up, Shaneth? In the house. Mm. <coughs> oh, something went down the wrong pipe. Yeah. Strippers must be getting tired of pour some sugar on me. 
Pour some sugar on me. Na 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 na. Pour some sugar on me. When 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 when. I'm hot, sticky, sweet, from my head to my feet. Na 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 na. You guys didn't think I knew it. Ha ha. It's like, uh oh, Andy got quiet. He must be inking something difficult. Not difficult. Just can't mess it up. I'm hot, sticky, sweet, <clears throat> from my head to my feet. Andy installed a stripper pole in the office for Christine. Pour some sugar on me as a staple in that studio. You're damn right it is. She can climb that stripper pole with just her legs, if you know what I mean. And it makes a squishy, squishy sound, so that's gross. Oh my God, are you talking about me again? Stop it, Andy. I will never get on that stripper pole again if you keep talking about me when I can't defend myself. Christine, you literally just defended yourself. What in the hell are you talking about, you psycho? <gasps> I am not a psycho. You take that back. That's my mother. And we don't like the word psycho with my mother. All right. I do this upside down. Got to make sure I get his nose right. I'm hot. Oh my God, now that's going through my head. I want to be thinking about that dumb song all day. Why didn't I just draw Vindicator on that cover? AJ, Tom, where the hell were you when I started this drawing? That would have been awesome. Damn it. Now I got to go out and buy another blank uh, Captain Cunnock cover and draw Vindicator and put them side by side. Oh, don't you think? I'll do it. I will go buy another blank cover and draw a Vindicator side by side. AJ dropping that knowledge. Where were you at the convention? Damn it. Now I got to ink his eyes. Eyes are the window to the soul. Man, this is great artwork. Who didn't like uh, this stuff? I love it. Love it. Love it. <clears throat> this is freaking coming out cool. Why didn't you just draw Vindicator? Oh, where were you?
This is amazing. I think this whole Captain Cunning and Vindicator are why Cannon and his Wolverine to counter the corny. Dude, I love Vindicator. Val Schnitzel, you got it. I was massless up at the lake, not in Orlando. Aren't you lucky? That's right. And subscribe and post the link to First Man Volume 2. I guess that's a good enough reason. So, guys, this whole cover so far has been inked with this one brush. Pretty nifty, huh? Don't let anybody tell you I don't know how to use a brush because they're wrong. Heavy Metal number 309 comes out today, by the way. That has the second chapter of CUDA. Is Vindicator the Guardian renamed? Yes. Vindicator is one of the best costume designs ever. Agreed. Using a brush is like a traditional draftsman bragging about his lettering skills to a bunch of CAD guys. Aw. Well, whatever. If you're wondering what I'm doing right now, I'm trying to think what my next work, line work is going to be. I've decided. It is going to be pointing the brush back up because I haven't used it in a while. Remember, if you don't use the brush for a while, you got to point it back up. All right, let's ink. Uh, this needs to be heavier. I think DNA is going to go on at 4.30 today, not 5, if anybody is uh, wondering. White out there. All right, let's do the flag symbols. Actually, he was Vindicator first. He was. I don't know why they changed his name. I have the, I have every issue of Alpha Flight that John Byrne did, and I have the omnibuses of his, but I don't know if it says in there why they changed his name. So. All right, let's do the flags. Oh, so it goes like that. Yes, I'm quiet because I'm inking this flag and I need to be very careful. 
very careful. There's a rabbit. I'm rabbit hunting. I'm rabbit hunting. You're like doofus, you messed the flag up. There's no point right here. Oh, I didn't mess it up. I just didn't draw it yet. Now you're like, but now you gotta use whiteout. No, I don't. I should introduce a Canadian superhero and first man. Take off the captain and just call him Canuck. Just kidding. Do you remember the publisher's name, Andy? Wait, hold on. I'm way behind. Isn't science amazing they managed to turn water into metal? Wait, damn it. I uh, wish I had John Byrne Alpha Flight. Um, yeah, it's great. Big Captain Canuck fan. Hyper Potato, hello. Do you remember the publisher's name? The Guardian of Maple Syrup. Let's get that maple leaf right now. The publisher's name of Captain Cunnock? Is that what you're talking about? What publisher are you talking about? Because I can look it right up. I'm sure it's on the spine of this book. Let's see. Oh, nope. That's IDW, but it was originally published by... Well, it was originally published by Richard Comley. And this trade paper, this book I have is issues four through ten. If it's four through ten, is this all George Freeman? Oh, yeah, I don't know. You can't introduce a Canadian. The border's closed. Oh, let's get that maple leaf right now. All right, let's do uh, his head flag or uh, symbol on his forehead. Had to thicken that up some. All right, let's see. Can't mess this one up. So far, so good. Hey, how good's my microphone? Can you hear me when I whisper? Can you hear me now? I'm whispering. Almost done. Audio's great again, Andy. Even when I whisper? Very nice. Jay Fabek has been doing store signings in Windsor, and I wasn't able to go up there. Well, that sucks. Loud and clear. Joe Staten's E-Man burns Doom Day plus one. Dude, I love E-Man. Uh, Dennis just collected. Dennis just bought uh, a whole run of E-Man and Megacon to uh, fill out his collection.
Of course, I have all my copies of E-Man, so I did not need to buy them. Well, the good thing about this whiteout I used, it's good for a uh, brush. Now, let's see. Do I want to do black on it? Oops. Oh, yeah. I forgot that line. Most important one. Oh, yeah. Captain Cunnock in the house. I just bought the Art of He-Man and the Master of the Universe book off Amazon. They had it on sale for $35. What? Damn, that's a good price. Ronald Shaw, DM me that link on Twitter, brother. Did Dennis sell his black holes? He did not. He did sell his G.I. Joe number one slabbed uh, copy, though. You should do some ASMR videos while drawing. What's ASMR stand for? I have no idea what that means. Damn, I feel old. Why do you guys say words I don't understand? Hopefully this isn't a mistake, but I feel like it needs some rendering right here. It's never a mistake, because if I don't like it, I can white it out. Oh, I do like that. Never mind. We think, guys, should I sign it with a brush? I've never signed anything with a brush before. I feel like I should. I feel like this needs to be beefier. Yep, it does. I also think this needs some rendering. Yep, it did. This needs to be a little heavier. Now nah, I want to sign it with a pen. I can't sign it with a brush. Ronald, send me the direct message for uh, that He-Man, Art of He-Man in the Masters of the Universe. I don't know if I have that. North Free, buddy, the stream's about to end. I finished this bad boy. I got to do a little bit of whiteout, but I can't really do that sitting here because I don't have my whiteout utensils over here. And I've got to erase it. But you've seen me ink a uh, sketch cover from start to finish. Wowzer Bowsers. I also have a sketch cover of Superman fighting Doomsday, but I got to finish penciling that one. So that could be a finished penciling stream. I sent it to via Twitter. Thank you, Ronald. I had a whole string of jokes that depended on Dennis selling his black holes. Dude, bring them up today. 430 Dennis and Andy show. Bring those jokes up today. Uh, let me uh, switch the camera around so you guys can see this. Look at that. There it is in the light. Hold on. Woo! Didn't mean to do that. All right. Here, let's see if this helps. It's Captain Canuck, all finished. Booyah. That's a fine-looking Canadian. It is a fine-looking Canadian. Thank you. It's Captain Canuck, after all. He's a fine-looking man. Uh, let's turn my uh, 
Cintiq back on and see if my uh, stream freezes. Hope not. When I'm doing that, turn that off. Hello. There we go. I'm back. Thank you very much. Uh, nice. Thank you. Hey, nobody told me what... Uh, do I pronounce Cunnock correctly? Of course I don't. I don't pronounce anything correctly. Hey, nobody told me what ASMR videos while drawing. What's an ASMR? You should do some ASMR videos while drawing. What does that mean? I don't know. Nobody needs to see. Uh... Oops. Boom. In closer. That microphone was bothering me. So what's ASMR? Tell me. Tell me. Look, guys, capping up the ink. Right here. That's what I use. autofocus black magic because it wants to focus on my face asmr is a genre of relaxation videos in which a certain sounds are made that is supposed to simulate feelings of relaxation to the listener well how the heck am i supposed to do those how do i exactly do those do i just talk in a calming voice here let's see oh Oh, there he is. So I'll get a scan of that, put it up. That was fun. All right, guys. Uh, seriously, I've always heard pros trash Higgins Inc. Uh, I don't mind Higgins Inc. Doesn't bother me. <gasps> What's that? It's First Man Volume 2, Learning Curve. First Man Volume 2, Learning Curve. Back it now. Be proud. Uh, guys, let's make this campaign grow and grow and grow. So uh, there's only one way to do that, and that's with you guys sharing, because sharing is caring. Uh, so please share the campaign, and uh, let's uh, let's pimp this brother out. You know what I mean? Pimp it, pimp it, pimp it, yo! Uh, let's see. Yes, that's exactly what you would do. But also, I was joking because you were whispering at the time. Guys. Guys. Let's get Andy Smith's First Man 2 learning curve. Oh, let's get it out to the masses. Everybody will love it. It's the book you need. The book you want. Get on it now. And do it just do it like this do it like this show luke henry after kicking monarch's ass to the depths of space is back on earth and now he's looking to save the world from the fourth world foundation sure he had help from a number before but she's not helping him this time. He's got to face it on his own. He's coming for a villain known as Adonis. He'll do it. You'll be there. Back, Back it, it now. now. First man two. There it is. Thank you, Hyper Kaiju. Can't do this without you guys. Share it around, guys. I'm going to tweet it as soon as I'm done here. Thank you all for joining me again on this fantastic trip 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 i totally enjoyed it uh you guys got to see me ink a whole sketch cover how cool is that from beginning to end i love you guys sincerely thank you again and uh you know until tomorrow Go ahead and go with it. Go ahead and go with it. Go ahead and go with it.